County school officials just confirmed the campus will indeed reopen at noon today. They say part of the reason they reacted so quickly to this threat is that former student was on campus just last week acting erratically. This is the alert students and staff at Cypress College received early this morning. Campus is closed and classes are canceled due to a credible threat of violence against the campus. It is kind of nerve wracking because it's like I'm just walking around at school. I'm just trying to get education, you know, but uh, yeah, I mean, it's not it's not a good feeling. Whittier police say a 24 year old man has been detained for mental health evaluation. His family, who lives in Whittier, said the man was distraught and allegedly told them he was going to shoot up a school. He didn't name which one, but because he recently attended Cypress College, school officials took quick action. Yes, his, his behavior on campus w was such that uh, we had concerns. A spokesperson for the college wouldn't be more specific about the former students' issues at the school. A security guard stood at the blocked entrance, turning cars away. Chris Van Ziel owns a salon across the street and was alarmed to hear the reason for the closure. A lot of the kids shop around here, come around here, come get haircuts after their classes, so it was pretty scary news. Whittier police say no weapons were found at the former student's home and no guns are registered to him. In response to recent events, Van Ziel says he's glad the school closed when it did. Don't take any chances, just shut it down, do the safest possible, you know, answer. Again, all business and classes will resume at noon at Cypress College. We've seen this security guard begin to let cars come into the parking lot. I'm sure those barricades will come down soon, and officials are reassuring students here that they are safe.